So how do you know if you or one of your clients is hitting a subconscious barrier that's preventing them from moving forward? Because you will set targets, like goals that you have set for them. And, you know, it could be making sales of a million dollars a year, but when they get to 500,000, like no matter what happens, it, it doesn't budge anymore. It doesn't go any higher than that. Or all of a sudden they stop doing all the things that were working for them. Why, why is that? It's because at some level for them, it's more dangerous to get to that number than not. Um, last week I was working with one of my clients and it was so funny because she, um, she has a business and I was just think, testing her on, um, I'm worth making $500,000 a year. Nope, she was not. I'm worth making $300,000 a year. Nope, she was not. She was stuck at 180. And it was so interesting because when she was a little kid, her parents who are really busy, they brought her to grandma to stay with grandma in another country. And because of that, she had created a story that she was not worthy because if she was worthy, her parents would have kept her and it had nothing to do with her worth. So we cleared that out. So now I checked her. Now it was $300,000 she was stuck on. And then she had another story. And you can see once you start working with your clients, would it be in sales and business and health and weight management or wherever you're working with, want they hit they hit a ceiling. And if you're astute, you'll know how to see that and then you know, ah, okay, now I know. And something that's so interesting for me is when I work with my clients and we're making great strides and all of a sudden they stop doing the good things they were doing because they know they're about to get those things they wanted. That's actually a really big one. When people actually know that they're going to get what they want, it's a very scary moment for a lot of people because that's a brand new world. It's often, guess what, connected to your birth because you go from one state of being to a brand new stuff of being and the birth process is like, you think you're going to die. So people often associate getting their goals but actually I'm going to die subconsciously. So it's super important to know about the subconscious belief and how to get rid of them to help yourself and your clients.